Blessed is a man who walks not in the counsel of the wicked, nor stands in the way of sinners, nor sits in the seat of scoffers. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and on his law he meditates day and night. He is like a tree planted by streams of water, that yields its fruit in its season, and its leaf does not wither. In all that he does he prospers. The wicked are not so, but are like chaff that the wind drives away. Therefore the wicked shall not stand in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For the Lord knows the way of the righteous, but the way of the wicked will perish. So you see these dots in my Bible above the words. They're beat markers. I was memorizing Psalm chapter 18, 50 verses long, and the Lord just showed me that I could put words to a beat, and it helps me to memorize them. And it's much, much better than just rote memorization. So I've been starting to go through the first 18 chapters of Psalms, which I have memorized, and putting all of them to a beat. And I've been deciding which words, which syllables receive the emphasis on the downbeats and how many syllables to put in a single beat. Sometimes one syllable, sometimes two, sometimes three, sometimes four syllables. Can't really fit more than four syllables in a beat if I go at that tempo. And yet, this is a very concept of how song is processed in a different part of the brain than speech. And song helps us to memorize. It's easy to memorize melodies and rhythms. That's why there are songs that stay with us throughout all of our life. And even the psalms themselves were actually musical songs. Keep training with your sword, the word of God. Those who live by the sword shall die by the sword. This is the one I live and die by. Stay strong, soldier.